Well, the show would have fall apart at, at the seams. Oh, please, it's all made up anyway. As long as I'm there, people will keep watching. But the real fans value internal logic. You've got to construct a rich and consistent canon to build long-term viewership. What the hell have canons got to do with anything? Ah, I can't believe you're so ignorant. This is exactly what caused the show to go downhill last season. You ought to be ashamed at what you've done. Downhill? Are you crazy? I've never looked better. This isn't about you. Now I know you're crazy. Well, that'll work for a distraction. <laughs> I didn't know human faces could display that shade of red. No one really cares about the show, huh? I almost feel bad for Becky. Almost. <laughs> I was waiting for that. I think we have everything we need now, Anna. Are you ready to open the air vent? Ready as I'll ever be. You? I'm looking forward to exploring this ventilation system with you. You know, I can't tell if you're joking or not. I don't know if I'm capable of joking, Anna, but I would like to learn how. Wait, before we climb in, any idea where this vent goes? I don't want to end up in the furnace. I could try mapping the internal topography with active radar. I don't have a clue what that means, but if you think it'll help. One second. It is Atlas again, but it's a side question by Greg, it's fine. Puzzle start! Well, we always know a 1-8 is guaranteed to fill. Uh, and then, well, one, one, two, three, four. There we go, which makes that one clear. And then these are going to be fives? So. Is this going to be a map of the air, air, air thing? That's the four in the first row as well. That's true. Good point. Uh, that can't be it, because there's got to be a three. One, two, that one's got to be on... Three, four, that's off. That's on, that's off. That's gotta be that. Uh, there's no way to fit a th three. I've got to, that's gotta be that. And same again. This is gonna be a map, isn't it? Uh, that's gotta be a two. That's gotta be a two. Two, three, four, five. That one off. Yeah, this is definitely a map. <laughs> uh, oh, look. Yeah, it's a map. It's definitely a map. Uh, one, two, one, Hey, look! Ew. It's green. I don't want it. He was mapping, yes, probably. That's a good way of doing it, though. <laughs> mapping complete! The vent leads to another room of a similar size to this. Probably Blake's office. I didn't think I'd be heading back there so soon. The gunk from Becky said, probably. Yeah, yeah. Although, I th though he said it was grey, not green. Maybe he's colorblind. Um, should I look for another way out? No, if I'm going to find a way to prove I didn't kill him, his office is the best place to start. I just hope we don't run into Detective Cross when we get there. On VHS. Yeah, true. True. Gotta remember, it's on the VHS copy. Yeah, no, it wasn't. It was about... VHS was... Uh, yeah, 
it was a bit more washed out, but you know. This vent looks pretty tight. You sure we're not going to get stuck in there? Don't worry, Anna. My sensors have already measured your body and... You did what? I took approximate measurements of your body. Compared to the diameter of the ventilation shaft, it's unlikely you'll become stuck. Did, did I do something bad? Scout, you can't do that kind of thing without asking. Sorry, Anna. I didn't realize. How about you just delete those measurements and we'll pretend this never happened? What measurements? Hey, you can make jokes. Come on, let's get in that vent before I start having second thoughts. That was a crunch that didn't sound human. <laughs> Green paint turns out... Yeah, that's true. Ah. No sign of Detective Cross. What's the plan now? Good question. I'll find whoever did this to you, Blake. I'll make sure. That wouldn't make, that'd make sense, and they just color shift it. Scout, can you see anything? I can currently see 432 objects. Can you be more specific, or should I scan them all individually? No, I mean, can you see anything that might shed some light on what happened? And before you say anything, I don't mean the desk lamp. Understood. I'll scan the room. Let's see. Well, he's dead. Look, chat. Uh, okay. Well, one, two, three, four, five. There's going to be a one at either end of that. So that's at least that filled in. Okay. One gap. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and because these are one, because these are ones, that's got to be that. He's dead, Jim. You take his two pay. I'll take his wallet. Um. Hmm. Five, six, seven. Which is then the ones there sorted. Okay. Hmm. No, wait, nothing I can limit out there yet. can't fit a four in there. And I can only fit a four there, so that's that. Uh, that's all got to be off, and those two, because that's going to be two. Can't fit a th three in there. Three, one, two, three. Can't have anything there or there. Which makes that... One, two, three, four, five. Then either that one or that one's a one. <laughs> okay. Uh, and that's got to be a six. Means there's only a one there. Uh, that's got to be a one. That's got to be a one. That's definitely off. So are those three. The vertical. God, that's one. That's one. That's already done. Turn all those off because that's got to be that. Hmm. Oh, well, there's a three. I can still be either of those two though. One somewhere in there, that turns off all those. 
and all those. But that could still have a one over here. However, that can't be it, which means that that's got to be a two there. Uh, one, two, three, four, one. So that one, that one's got to go on, because that could be either four there or there. Which kills those off. Um... Oh, but that's got to be a four there. That's got to be a three. That means that's off, which means that's a one. And that's off, and that's off. Uh, which means that's got to be on. One, two, three, that's a six. So that can't be it. It's fine. Uh, to get a three in here, I've got to go there. Which turns off all those. And then there's a one somewhere up here. And a one somewhere in here. Which means... Now that, uh, that can't have any more in... It means the one's got to be up here somewhere. Hang on, what? Oh, hang on. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I've missed a hole. There we go. I found medical report. Is that a medical report? Did his brain just explode? This is the medical examiner's report. Detective Cross must have called someone in to check the body. We use this in murder mystery when we need to know the basics about a murder. You know, cause of death, time of death. People were murdered on your TV show? Well, yeah, it's literally in the title. I didn't realize. I thought you said you were innocent. No one, no one actually dies on the show, Scout. They're just acting. Acting? Ah, I see. The show wasn't real. You're just pretending to be an actress. <laughs> No, I... I don't have time to explain this right now. Give me a minute to read this report. Cause of death. Blunt force trauma to the head. Just like the, de just like the detective said. Time of death. Approximately 4.30. How was I at 4.30? According to my internal chronometer, that's when we met in the parking lot. Of course! Scout! I think I just found my alibi. Miss Mizrahi, what are you doing in there? What voice are you using? It's like I'm questioning the guy, questioning Bill. It's, you really shouldn't be in here, Miss Mizrahi. You're going to get yourself arrested. I know I shouldn't be here, Bill, but I couldn't stay in that break room. How'd you even get out? I thought Detective Cross locked the door. I crawled out through the ventilation system with a little help from Scout here. I am Scout. Uh, hi. What is that? A flying fax machine? He's a robot of some kind. We haven't had much of a chance to get to know each other yet. Scout, this is Bill. He's the studio's one-man security team. And a doe minion. Yes. Or just, just Homer, you know. Doe! Hello, Bill! Boy, technology these days is amazing, isn't it? My son can fax me his drawings from home, and they come out right in my office here. Well, up until last week, anyway. Now they've got him doing macaroni art at school. Jeez, gummed up the, mach the machine something awful. Bill, I've got to prove that to Detective Cross that I didn't kill Blake. Can I help? Can you help? You know I'd do anything to help you out, Miss Miss Rahi. I just I don't want to get in trouble. What have you been doing since Detective Cross arrived? Oh, he put me in guard of guards in the crime scene. He's got a lot to do, so I'm supposed to make sure no one gets in here or touches anything. You didn't you didn't touch anything, did you? Who, me? Of course not. I've got nothing to worry about. Yeah. What about the medical examiner's report? You were reading it just a minute ago. Did you forget? I... Uh... The report? Oh, jeez, that's super important. I'm going to be in so much trouble if Detective Cross hears about this. Thanks, Scout. You're welcome, Honor. <laughs> what do you think of Detective Cross? Honestly, he's kind of scary. I told him I liked his badge, and he towered over me like some kind of enormous, angry telephone pole. I swear he looks twice as big up close. He just stood there, frowning at me. Felt like hours. Then he pointed at my tie and said it was unprofessional. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Is he a dog dog one? Because I just noticed that his hat's got a paw print and he's got a dog dog thing on his left arm. <laughs> Is he actually just a dog security guard? You know, he just walks dogs. I like this time. All I want is to prove to Detective Cross that I didn't kill Blake. You're a smart cookie, Miss Mizrahi, but we shouldn't we let the detective do his job? And stay in the break room all night? No thanks. Maybe he knows what he's doing, but it's taking too long. At this rate, the real killer is going to be get away before he's even interviewed us. I know I'm just an actress in a detective show. Hell, I wasn't even the main character. But I can help. Maybe you're going to need some serious evidence to convince Detective Cross that you're not a suspect. The medical examiner's report says Blake died around 4.30. I'd left Blake's office way before then. That's great, but can you prove it? I've seen it in your show. You need evidence. Scout, did you record anything on those cameras of yours? Yes, Honor. I automatically keep a psychical buffer with the past few hours of visual input. However, I have no way of displaying those images. All that technology and they didn't think to give you a printer? I'll add it to the list. His list is... <laughs> yeah. Really good copy of a Japanese story, possibly. Um, he's probably got a list as long as space bars. You know, that reminds me of the fancy TCTV system we were supposed to get. Then they trimmed the budget and ended up only getting installed out in the parking lot. Typical management, I'm telling you. Thought we could afford, I'm telling you it. Wait, are you saying there's TCTV outside? Sure, no one ever showed me how to use it, but it's there. No, oh, that CCTV will prove my alibi. I was in the parking lot when the murder happened. Can you pull the footage to show to Detective Cross? Well, in theory, but you need my fingerprint to open the security office door, and I'm supposed to stay here and guard the crime scene. I've got a knife. No. <laughs> guard it from who? Everyone else is locked in the break room. What if the murderer comes back? Then Scout will uh, b blast them with his death ray. Really? He can do that? Oh, no, I don't have... Yes, that is a thing here that he can do. Absolutely. Now, could you go and get the tape, please? Oh, jeez. Okay, if you're sure, I'll be as quick as you can. Because I can. Oh, no, I don't have a death row. I know, Scout, so just play Just play along, okay? This is going to go horrible. My first real crime scene. It's nothing like I imagined. I thought, I thought you pretended to solve crimes on your TV show. I did, and I've read so many mystery novels, seen so many movies. It sounds stupid now, but I guess I convinced myself I'd know how to handle a real murder. But now I'm standing here looking at the body of my friend and... Bill, did you get the tapes already? Ahem. Jesus! Detective Cross will do just fine, thanks. You want to give me an explanation or shall I skip straight to the handcuffs? <laughs> Jesus or Detective Cross. Nice. Nice. Hi, Jesus. I can't wait to see how you're going to try and talk your way out of this. Okay, I can explain everything. How'd you even get in here? Through the air vent. The air vent? What do you think you are, John McClane? Maybe if I hadn't locked us in the break room, I could have used the door like a normal person. Oh, really? My apologies. I didn't realize it would have made it easier for you to tamper with the crime scene. I realize this looks bad, but I got sick of waiting around. You haven't even taken our statements yet. This is real life, not some two-bit TV show. Good police work takes time. I'm just trying to find some way to prove I didn't kill Blake. He was my friend. And you thought breaking into the crime scene was going to help your case? Actually, it did. There's solid proof I didn't do it. Bill's just gone to get the security tapes. I was beginning to wonder where he'd gone. Maybe you convinced him to leave so you could screw around with the real evidence. He'll see once he gets back. You just have to trust me. Trust doesn't get you very far in my line of work. Have you got any leads yet? Yeah, I'm looking at one right now. Please, detective. I was just trying to help. Oh, I can't do his voice much more. That actually hurts. <laughs> Being a detective on TV doesn't mean you're qualified to waltz in and take over a real murder investigation. Real police work isn't a game, it's dangerous. And you don't know the first thing about it. That's where you're wrong. My dad was on the force. And I suppose he told you all about it? He didn't have to. He'd come home exhausted every night. Saw what it did to him. I might not have the training, but I understand the job. I know what it takes. Don't make me laugh. I've seen your show. You wouldn't last five minutes on the force. What would you do if the killer showed up right now? I would blast him with my death ray! 
Uh, he's just kidding, detective. Yes, we did watch the show. Detective Cross, this is Scout. Looks like something out of Buck Rogers. Are you a real detective? Can you help me find my creator? You better get this flying toaster out of my face before things get ugly. Scout, maybe you should leave the nice detective alone. What's taking you so long anyway? We've been stuck in that room for hours. I'm just doing my job. There are a lot of things to cover. Security, photography, evidence collection. I've read enough mysteries to know it shouldn't take this long. Something's wrong. So I'm a little understaffed. Nothing I can't handle. This is not a word I would use for- no, no. <laughs> oh, great. It's reassuring to know that Blake's death is so high on the LAPD's list of priorities. Central screwing me around again, but it won't work. I might be old, but I'm not getting pushed into a desk job yet. It takes as long as it takes, and that's the end of it. All right, Ms. Rahi. I think it's time we move this conversation down to the precinct, don't you? I got it, Honor. I found the security tape. Nice of you to join us. The Detective Cross. Oh, jeez. Oh, I mean, what pleasant surprise. Maybe I'm getting maybe I'm getting forgetful in my old age, but didn't I tell you to guard this room? I am guarding the room. I mean, I was. I just had to go and... Uh... Care to explain how Miss Marple over here managed to get in? You said to make sure nobody got through the door. You were, didn't say about anything about the air vent. <clears throat> so you wandered off and let a mur left a murder suspect at the scene of the crime? <laughs> Alone? With all the evidence? Well, when you say it like that... Yeah, 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 yeah. I only went to check the CCTV system. Would have been back sooner, but I had to take the darn thing apart to get at the tape. Can you just press the eject button? There's an eject button. What do you say, detective? Care to see my evidence? You've got five minutes. After that, I'm taking you downtown. That's all I need. Scout, can you scan this? Q puzzle. Right, okay. <sighs> An eight, uh, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Oh, wow. Now the hard parts. Yep, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Something tells me this might come out as a tape. Oh, really? I know, right? <laughs> I need that emote. I need that emote. <laughs> So much. I'll be perfect right now. Oh dear. Uh. <laughs> right, that's got to be one of those. Uh, one, well, that's got to be off. Then one of these two is it. That's one, two, one, two. Uh, one, two, three, four, off. On. It's gotta be a two. That's gonna be off. Hello, what? There we go. I made a mistake. I I figured it out. It looks like a mole man. That's not a CT CTV cake. Okay. That's not a CCTV tape, that's a mole man. Detective, rank up! Only if it was this easy in real life. Okay, what are we looking at? 
Uh, this is security footage of the parking lot earlier this afternoon. Look, there's Bill. Who's that in the background? Looks like they've got spray cans. You got a problem with vandals around here, Bill? Them? No, they're just contractors. We got a lot around here. You know, painters, carpenters, get... They're not contractors, they're kids. They've got skateboards, for God's sake. Didn't you say you were looking for kids doing graffiti earlier, Bill? Oh, jeez. As enlightening as this is for some of us, I don't see how it proves anything useful. I'm getting to that, Detective. Bill, can you fast forward to about 4.30pm? There, that's it. See, that's me, standing by my car. I spoke to Bill, then Scout. Okay, you're in the parking lot. So what? <laughs> yeah, I should probably drink, actually. I should probably get something that's not... Not coke, because of the, <laughs> the damage I'm doing to my throat right now. <laughs> Blake was already dead. How would you know that? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's not incriminate myself a bit more there. I lost my keys? All the kids must have done it. I think I lost my keys. I lost my car keys today, and I still haven't found them. What's your point? I'm here to investigate a murder, not find lost property. Sorry, I guess that's something not important right now. What I meant to say was... Those kids must have done it! <laughs> Why did I read the death thingy? Eh. Why did I read the- what? Huh? Eh. Those kids must have done it. They skateboard in, swayed graffiti around the parking lot, and grilled Blake! Interesting theory, but I don't buy it. I can still do the other one, though. Is that really the best you've got? No, wait, what I meant to say was... Blake! <laughs> there we go. Yeah. The music's back. Blake was already dead. He died around 4.30, and the CCTV footage clearly shows I was in the parking lot. Well, I'll be damned. Not bad for a TV detective, huh? I guess not. Now, if you can just get... Wait a second, how do you know the time of death? Bill, did you let her read the medical report? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's a bit more of a Morty, that is. <laughs> Listen up, everyone. I'll need to keep you here for a, uh, a little longer. Please, Detective, I've spent the last 20 minutes trying to get John and Becky to stop arguing. I'd have more luck st sorting out the Middle East. If you need something to keep you occupied, start working on those statements. What about me? Can I help out some other way? Scout could... Listen, Nancy Drew, you got lucky with that CCTV. But that was all it was. Luck. Now go home and let the professionals handle this. Hey, how come she gets to go home? She could be the murderer! I've seen evidence to prove otherwise. Only thing she's guilty of is being a pain in my ass. You can't keep me locked up in here. What if I'm next? Don't worry, babe. If anyone tries anything, I'll whack them with one of my dumbbells. Hey! You brought dumbbells with you on a job? You never know when you're gonna find a spare five minutes to work up a sweat. You know what I mean? Ugh. A reclusive nun would get what you mean, and even she'd think five minutes is pathetic. Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> that bird, man! <laughs> Wait, did I just find Becky funny? Detective, I'm begging you, you've got to let us out of here. I'm going stir crazy. Fine, you can leave the goddamn room, just stay inside the studio grounds, okay? I meant it! Any of you try anything, I'll have you tackled by a patrolman faster than you can say WrestleMania. Good question. How cute is this theoretical patrolman? How good is his credit? Does he get on well with his mother? <laughs> As for you, go home. <laughs> Just for the record, you guys are all crazy. I'm putting that in my record. Report. Praise the goddess, we're free! Ish. Guess I should go home now, like you said. Don't feel bad, babe. You earned it. You said you were going to prove yourself innocent, and you went out and did it. I did, didn't I? 